Hey guys, so the video that you guys are about to watch is my four days and me starting this vegetarian vegan um, OMAD challenge and uh, check out this video and at the end of this video I'm going to tell you guys um, basically how I felt throughout this whole challenge and how much uh, or eat whether I lost any weight and yeah, I'll just let you guys just uh, let you guys see what I had and then we're going to talk about it at the end of this video. Guys, day one day one of uh, my 30-day OMAD vegetarian challenge and um, I just want to show you guys what I'm having for breakfast or what I'm doing in, in for breakfast basically so let me show you so I literally just cut up some lemon and I'm boiling some water this is actually my second cup I have been a busy bee this morning, so I actually put some, what's it called, apple cider vinegar inside as well, and I don't know if you follow me on my fitness channel, but my fitness page on Instagram, but I found this um, blueberry apple cider, and it actually has honey in it, which I don't mind, but um, yeah, it tasted really, really good, so I'm just having some, the rest of this and I basically drank most of it. Let me drink, let me finish this up and then I'm gonna pour some more hot water. So in addition to my um, hot water, lemon, apple cider mixture, I just had this that I also got from Publix. This is um, a digestion shot with ginger and probiotics and it has some coconut water, pineapple juice, ginger, apple cider vinegar, lemon juice. I didn't know that it had apple cider vinegar in it. Camu Camu, um, ginseng extract, cayenne pepper. But you guys seen it. So basically, this is what I drank in addition to this, and that is it. That's basically all I had. And so um, I'm going to stop my fast around two or three o'clock and um basically so basically with omad what you do is um you eat within an hour and so i like to consume within an hour like 1200 calories 1200 or more calories i'll just say that and so i'm doing some prepping so let me show you guys so yesterday i said that i was going to show you guys some prepping and didn't get a chance to because i was super tired and so let me show you guys just a little bit of what I prepped. So this is some jasmine rice. I also have um, the coconut ginger rice that I showed you guys the other day. And um, yes, yeah, so that's the rice that I'm prepping. I have some more rice here. Then I have some oatmeal that I'm, I'm going to be having with my meal today. This is um, whole grain oats whole grain oats and then I made some dinner this is dinner for the kids this is a pot roast that I'm cooking so when I tell you that I'm a busy bee I am a busy bee so I just want to give you guys uh, let you guys know that and later on I will show you guys my um, my meals on what I'm gonna do I already have it written down and I've been prepping and just doing a lot of reading doing a lot of researching and so Yes, you guys are going to get all of this and more once this whole challenge is over, how I feel and everything else, and just go from there. And that's it, guys. So this is just a prep. I just finished the caramelized apples over my oatmeal. That's about a cup, and that's just one apple with probably like... A tablespoon of maple syrup and this is the sausage that's the Italian I had to take the casing off and this is just one sausage with a whole bunch of veggies onions and peppers and this is it that I've been using I used a, pur a purple pepper and like a regular green one um, I got this from the farmers market and I'm just trying to see if I should add more sausage but I'm just gonna try it out and see what happens After I 
chopped up all of the veggies and the sausage and I'm just heating it up and I seasoned it with salt free Mrs. Dash, the garlic and herb yep. and my coconut ginger rice, jasmine rice is pretty much done and I'm going to add that with so I'm thinking of I'm thinking I might use this with um, the sausage mi mixture and either have it as a rice just by itself and uh, with the coconut rice and this by itself and then later on add this for tomorrow and I could have like a spaghetti or some type of penne pasta and that will also be one of my meals hey so guys we'll so I am breaking my fast it is three o'clock and I am about to show you my meal all right, so this is the one cup of oatmeal with uh, one apple. This is basically my caramelized maple syrup oatmeal with a really tall glass of water with some lemon. This is the um, Italian sausage, the coconut ginger jasmine rice, the chili mac and cheese, and a biscuit with some jelly. All of this is um, 1,280 calories, and a and one and basically my um, RX bar as well. I'm gonna have the ginger flavor, okay? Like I showed you guys in in my um, haul. So let me on camera just show you guys what it tastes like. So this is the sausage that I'm trying right now. That's really good. Now I'm trying trying the chili. This is dairy free mac and cheese with chili. That's good. Wow, this is really good. This is some good stuff. And this is the rice. I love jasmine rice anyway. The coconut ginger is really good. The sausage tastes good. I'm gonna try my maple apples. Mm hmm That is good as well. Really good. So, um, let me just let you guys know that I was counting down the time. I was getting really hungry. And um, I could not wait to try my um, my meal. Because I never tried any of the, the sausage. I never tried the mac and cheese. And I was just kind of scared that it wouldn't be good. <laughs> but I am very surprised and happy that it tastes really good. So... I'm gonna enjoy this and that is it after this I have to go pick up my kids so this is actually really good timing and then I will see you guys on day two good morning guys I look crazy right <laughs> I actually um, just came back from dropping off my kids at the bus stop and I'm drinking my hot water with lemon and apple cider vinegar I love this. I look forward to this every morning, and this is just fabulous, awesome, fantastic in the morning. Okay, I definitely love it. Um, so yesterday, I told you guys that I was going to eat my RX bar that I showed you in my Audi haul. Didn't even get a chance to do that. So I guess my calories were about 1,070 calories. And so I still felt full. I still felt fine. Like I had a lot of energy. So I'm thinking this time I'm going to up my calories a little bit more. I'm going to have some more greens and maybe do a salad and a protein shake or something instead of oatmeal. I will see. I'll see what I'll do because I don't have any bananas and I really want some bananas. So there's a couple of things that I'm trying to do. So I want to do that. And what else? 
yeah so i'll show you guys my um, okay guys my meal so for today we are and so on, i just want to let you guys uh, day know two, that i have my and day two i am prepping chili and, and in my chili i'm I gonna add it. this um tuned, vegan sausage italian sausage flavored oh. three peppered or three onion pepper blend some onion powder and chili powder and inside of my uh, chili, I'm going to add some vegetarian baked beans. It has a lot of really good um, ingredients like onion powder, garlic powder, um, brown sugar. It also has tomatoes, tomato paste. It has some navy beans in there. And I want to add all of that goodness inside of my chili with diced tomatoes with serrano peppers. And this will also have a little bit of a bite. So everything is pretty much in there, mostly all of my ingredients. I just have to chop up the, the sausage. And this is everything. This is what everything looks like inside of my um, crock pot. I'm basically now just stirring all of the ingredients, stir stirring the, the seasonings, the peppers, the onions, the um, vegetarian baked beans, and um, like I said, the seasoning and the, the sausage and peppers and beans. I also added black beans inside of this um, as well. You can add uh, canned black beans. I didn't have any, and so I just... Uh, prepped it the, the night before, soaked it overnight, boiled the beans, and I just added inside of this chili. And I'm really excited in trying something new. You know, this is something that I've never made before, and I'm just excited to try something that, um, like I said, is, I prepped and I'm going to make tomorrow. So here's me trying it out and i am just shocked at how much flavor is inside of this chili and it's vegetarian it's very meaty and i'm just excited to try it so here is either day two or day three of my meal um this is uh, day two. This is my bread with peanut butter and bananas. I have boiled eggs. I have potatoes with peppers with um, Italian sausages. I use two. Here is some homemade granola that I got from the farmer's market. It's pecan cranberry flavored. I also have some veggies, some cucumbers, spring mix, um, olive... Uh, olives and boiled egg and that is my meal i believe i'll put the calories on it and this is so far um what the chili looks like it, it has been in there cooking for a couple of hours and i just wanted to show you guys what i what it looked like with some condiments on it i have put some um, apple spice on my uh, toast and some ketchup on my um potatoes so here is day three my meal and the calories of my day three just some leftovers that i had and this is day four the chili with the coconut ginger rice jasmine rice my granola with um dairy-free yogurt and some leftover potatoes with some um cauliflower hash Okay, guys, so what do you guys think? Um, day four. Actually, today is day five, and every Monday, I just felt like I think it's better that um, I just come in and just give you guys a, a recap on my, I guess, my previous week days and just um, let you know the update and how I felt. Guys, I actually feel great. Like, um, I think the first day is when I actually felt like I want to, and it was probably more anxiousness than being hungry because it was something new and I was looking forward to trying new foods and I'm still getting used to it. Like, this is still something new. Um, it's just basically a lot of new foods that I'm just trying to see if I should have it as a rotation. And so the chili was really great and that is going to be something that, um, I'm going to be eating throughout my whole journey. And so um, I froze the leftover chili and I didn't even finish that whole bowl, guys. Um, that bowl was was really big. And so I probably ate maybe like less than half of that and everything else is what I ate. And so um, another thing that I've also incorporated too was um, remember in the beginning, I was telling you guys that every morning I have my lemon water with... Um, apple cider vinegar 
And that is something that I'm definitely gonna have in the morning, but also have the same thing, not the apple cider vinegar, but just the hot water and lemon at night. And so I see that um, it's like a benefit for me. And so I'm gonna try that. And so far I've lost four pounds, guys, four pounds, four pounds. So I'm 176 and um yeah so that's really encouraging i'm i'm really in encouraged that um this is something that um uh, maybe i can do i don't know we'll, we'll we'll just see how the rest of the days go and weeks and um that's basically it so let me know if you have any comments or questions in the description or in the comments below and we could talk about it okay thank you guys so much for watching turn into my next video god bless